डायमैग्नेटिक पैरामैग्नेटिक एंड फेरोमैग्नेटिक मटेरियल्स फर्स्टली लेट मी टीच यू दैट व्हाट आर मैग्नेटिक मटेरियल्स वेल दोज मटेरियल्स दैट कैन बी इजीली मैग्नेटाइज्ड एंड कैन बी यूज्ड टू मेक मैग्नेट आर कॉल्ड मैग्नेटिक मटेरियल्स फॉर एग्जांपल कंसीडर आयरन निकल एंड स्टील वी नो दैट मैग्नेट अट्रैक्ट्स द आयरन मैग्नेट अट्रैक्ट्स द निकल and magnet attracts the steel so iron is a magnetic material nickel is a magnetic material and steel is a magnetic material just remember that materials that are easily magnetized are called magnetic materials now there are three primary categories of magnetic materials like diamagnetic materials paramagnetic materials and ferromagnetic materials Diamagnetic materials are those materials which are weakly repelled by a magnet. For example, when you place gold in a magnetic field, it is weakly repelled by the magnet. While paramagnetic materials are those materials which are weakly attracted by a magnet. For example, when you place aluminum in a magnetic field, it is weakly attracted by a magnet. while ferromagnetic materials are those materials which are strongly attracted by a magnet for example when you place an iron in a magnetic field it is strongly attracted by a magnet secondly if we place diamagnetic materials in a magnetic field they are weakly magnetized in opposite direction of magnetic field for example if magnetic field is in this direction then diamagnetic materials are magnetized in opposite direction while paramagnetic materials are weakly magnetized in the same direction of magnetic field for example if the magnetic field is in this direction then diamagnetic materials are magnetized in the same direction while ferromagnetic materials are also strongly magnetized in the same direction of magnetic field For example if the magnetic field is in this direction the ferromagnetic materials are magnetized in the same direction thirdly when a diamagnetic rod is freely suspended in a uniform magnetic field it slowly aligns itself in a direction perpendicular to the applied magnetic field for example magnetic field is in this direction the diamagnetic rod will slowly align itself in a perpendicular direction when a paramagnetic rod is freely suspended in a uniform magnetic field it slowly aligns itself parallel to the applied magnetic field for example magnetic field is in this direction the paramagnetic rod will slowly align itself parallel to the applied magnetic field When a ferromagnetic rod is freely suspended in a uniform magnetic field it quickly aligns itself parallel to the applied magnetic field for example magnetic field is in this direction the ferromagnetic rod will quickly align itself parallel to the applied magnetic field fourthly diamagnetic materials lose their magnetism on removal of external magnetic field while paramagnetic materials also lose their magnetism on removal of external magnetic field while ferromagnetic materials do not lose their magnetism on removal of external magnetic field remember that they are permanent magnet fifthly in a non uniform magnetic field the diamagnetic materials move from a stronger to a weaker field due to repulsion For example in the non uniform magnetic field this diamagnetic materials move from a stronger to a weaker field while in a non uniform magnetic field the paramagnetic materials move from a weaker to a stronger field with a weaker traction for example in this non uniform magnetic field the paramagnetic materials move from a weaker to a stronger field due to weak attraction While in a non-uniform magnetic field the ferromagnetic materials move from a weaker to a stronger field due to strong attraction for example in this non-uniform magnetic field 
This ferromagnetic materials move from a weaker to a stronger field due to strong attraction. Sixthly, the examples of diamagnetic materials are copper, gold, silver, water, air, argon, hydrogen, etc. While the examples of paramagnetic materials are aluminium, chromium, alkali metals, alkaline earth metals, platinum, oxygen, etc. While the examples of ferromagnetic materials are iron, cobalt, nickel, steel, etc.